Hello. And number one from uh, from lockdown. Again from the uh, shape of a tulip bird. And in the book, the poems flip between uh, the two characters in the story. One goes from uh, one poem could be from a male point of view, and the other could be from a female. And anyway, but let me just read to you. Read you there. This one's called "My Dear Night Beside You." Home to the tap house, a harbour of acid glass, halo clouds of weightless silver above the seaweed, the colour of shadows beneath our feet. A back stay, the sun's lit fuse comes into the room as a wanderings of the burning bush. The steel pearls olive touch. I've watched the knot behind your ears fall in ribbon arms over the afternoon, pulled on and loosened by the drink and saw bread. A rhythm of joy under the breath, a staggering happiness as if still hiding from itself. You were where the sea bone is breaking, talking of nature and the light as Mary's robe is falling, where white marigolds come rushing in, touching our feet in a rare feeling of liberty. And a false consciousness of eternity, when it is a day simply repeating itself in the syntax of weathering, on rock limbs, shell skin, a labouring sea. The light changes, but the drink doesn't. High tides of whiskey and water and a beckoning tongue of a carving moon and your rhythm is the rattle of armour. Your thoughts of the blackbird song and it soon becomes the only language travelling from hand to mouth. Stumbling when happiness makes herself unavailable. The seafarers go where horizons dip. Colourless until they share their warm nebula, their petal stars of home, and my dear night beside you. Now you are lost amongst the island lights. You are nothing but pity's drunk.